What's up guys? I'm Adam Morgan from Cinnabar Calisthenics and today's lesson is the bodyweight row. The bodyweight row is an undeniably effective pulling exercise. With very little equipment, you have a safe, accessible, and progression-friendly exercise to train your back. And by accessible, I mean you don't need a lot of equipment to do it. And by progression-friendly, I mean that even if you're a beginner or elite, the bodyweight row is an effective exercise that you're going to be able to use throughout your entire lifetime of training. Let's get straight to it. Here's how you do a bodyweight row. To do a bodyweight row, start by placing your feet on a stable surface. With a tight core and legs, imagine driving your elbows back, lifting yourself until your chest is roughly in line with your wrists. Lower back down with control until you're back into the starting position. Now that we know how to do a bodyweight row, let's discuss three of the most common mistakes I see and how to fix them. Number one, pulling with your arm. To fix this, you wanna think about relaxing your grip and even unwrapping your thumb from around the bar or around the rings. You wanna imagine your fingers serving as a claw that you wrap around the handle, and then you drive your elbow backwards to properly utilize your back muscles. Mistake number two is having a poor range of motion because you're doing a variation of a row that's too difficult for you. The solution here is simple. Check your ego and do a bodyweight row that you can actually do with good form. It's not always the easiest thing to do, but we want high quality reps rather than high quantity reps with a variation of the row that we can't even do. And mistake number three, not controlling your weight. Now this really applies to any exercise, but it's very easy to do with a bodyweight row because we're hanging and gravity is acting on us the entire time. Pulling yourself up is hard, but don't get sloppy once you're at the top and let your body fall back down into the starting position. Control your weight throughout the entire movement. Like a lot of other bodyweight exercises, the bodyweight row is also one you can scale to make it either easier or more difficult. If you want to make the bodyweight row easier, you want to get into an incline position where you're a little bit closer to standing. And if you wanna make it more difficult, adjust your body angle in the opposite direction. Get your feet a little bit higher so that you're hanging in more of an inverted position. And of course, we can always make the exercise more difficult by adding additional weight to our body by using a weighted vest or even a weight plate resting on our chest. As I mentioned earlier, one of the good things about the body weight row is that it's pretty accessible. So it's one exercise that you can do on rings. You can also do it on parallel bars if they're high enough. And if you have some furniture around the house that is built in a way that's friendly to the body weight row, you could even do body weight rows using a table or even maybe a really high chair. Well, I hope you guys enjoyed this video and found it informative. This is just one of the many exercises that I have within my bodyweight basics matrix, which covers some of the fundamental exercises in the world of bodyweight fitness. And this series is dedicated to covering how to do those fundamental bodyweight exercises. So if you enjoyed this video, consider leaving a like on the video and maybe even subscribing to the channel. And if you have any questions, feel free to leave a comment below. I read all of the comments that you guys leave on these videos. So if you leave a comment, I will get back to you. As always, thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you in the next video. Thank mm -hmm. you.